Is there not a single person left? It very much seems that way. Perhaps this oddness with the air drove them to escape to safer climes. Hope so. At least that would mean they're still alive. I think we're nearly there. Well done, me. here. Meaning what exactly? Uh, forget it. Monsters here, huh? Are you hoping for a little exercise? People are so much more fragile than you realize. Is that a philosophical musing I hear? No, just thinking about tearing zombies apart. This place is fun. I imagine it was once. Happy, smiling faces on every corner. No, I can picture it now. Damn. Everything just looks... broken. Not exactly the most poetic of descriptions, but yes, I suppose it does. Is there nowhere that's not, like... Broken by this shit? I suppose there might be somewhere.
place. I could use a rest. Did you find something? Much, but you never know. Bad, I guess. Yes, ought to come in handy.
Almost there. Roger that. around here. Herbal medicines with Janoon stock in trade. Well, that ought to come in handy. Should be safe here. Good. Sounds like trouble. Yes, and given what we've seen so far, I'd say you need to be very careful in case you're planning on investigating. Shit! What is it now? Is this the break shit's doing too? I believe so. It corrupts everything it touches before destroying it completely. Now hurry up and get out of here while you still can.
bad. Very bad. Take cover. Nice work. Show him what you've got. Stung a little. No time to recuperate. Stay on your feet. Has anyone ever told you how soft you are? Hey, fuck off. Let me guess. I'm gonna need more cover. And quickly! Look out! That was close. There. That must be his weak point. I knew it would have a weak point. Don't worry, you're not gonna die. Unless you get That's your idea of encouragement? Die if you fall from up here. I... 
Hopefully one that isn't deserted. Well, you'll never find... Out if you don't go and see. Huh. Oh, oh, hey, hey, over here. Oh, we're saved. What the hell? Move, monster! Hey, the fuck you calling monster? The monster speaks! Yeah, of course I speak! Put your pointy stick away, asshole! Move! Alright? Move it! Where are we now? This is the city of Sipol. Why are they speaking English? It's my experience that languages share commonalities across many dimensions. Okay. Any answer works for me, I guess. Quiet! Keep moving, Fiend! Ugh, of course. Back in court. Humble thyself and answer their questions. I got this. I'm used to repping thyself. I don't think you comprehend the gravity of your situation. I gotten myself out of much tougher scrapes than this, thank you very much. So why don't you shut your shiny mouth and let me do the talking? Good her. She speaks with invisible beings. Does she in cahoots with demons? What? No. And and who uses cahoots? I would like to hear the answer to Councilwoman Bullet's question, child. My name is Frey Holland. I do not know how I got here. I am exhausted. I am starving, and all I want is to go home. Her vestments are strange. Where is she from? Hell's Kitchen. You see? She is Hell's Spawn. How else could she survive in the corruption? Please. How did you emerge from the corruption into you? Unscathed. I wouldn't exactly say unscathed. It is because she and the corruption are one and the same. We must execute her immediately! Wait, what? No, that's crazy! I don't even know how I got here! Please, listen to me. I believe we need her. Who wishes to address the council? Forgive me, I am Odin Keen. All oh, this woman is guilty of is surviving the corrupted lands. We have much to learn from her. Until now, we've only met her with blades. Perhaps we could extend her a hand of kindness. The devil will accept your kindness, as it bites your hand, spreading its venomous corruption into your veins. We must deal with this interloper swiftly. Councilwoman Ballette, please! Both 
Thank you. Council members have made very compelling arguments. Council is divided. Therefore, there shall be no blood spilled today. But, heed my warning, child. If you prove a threat, we will have no choice but to eliminate you. Take her to the Tower of Binoy. Please, Council Member your ruling is too harsh. Council is adjourned. She has done nothing wrong. Wait, what, uh, Tower of Binoy? What's the Tower of Binoy? I believe it's a prison. Please! What? Oh, hell no, I'm not getting locked up again. Let me go! Let me go! Don't touch me, asshole! Oh. Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Get up! Look. I am imprisoned, a million miles from home, in a Ren Faire nightmare. Just let me die in peace. If you die, I'm just a meaningless bauble that they bury you with. And I am fine with that. Just leave me alone. You know what? None of this is my fault. This is all your and fucking fault. Tell me fault. how exactly this is my fault. Can we just not talk? I. Fine by me. Suit yourself. I love a bit of silence. Fantastic. You say another fucking word. You know, I never thought I'd miss the Hell's Kitchen courthouse. Did that piss bucket do something to annoy you? No. You know what? You did. Because of you, I'm not getting back to... New York? New York. How hard is that to remember? Hmm. Maybe it's hard to remember as Vambrace? If memory serves me right, you weren't exactly in the best of spirits when our paths first crossed. I'm not sure why you're so determined to return. You know what? I'm just... And then use magic to bust us out of here. It isn't advisable to use your abilities in front of them. Why not? They already think I'm in cahoots with demons! But they will hang you for being a heretic. Well, like a Salem situation? Do you expect me to know what that means? <sighs> Look, we, we did it your way, and now we're gonna try it my way. <sighs> Did I just do that? Quick, put this on. Who's there? I will free you, but you have to put it on and do as I say. Okay, it's on. You. 
You're the one who stood up for me in court. Why are you doing this? Because I believe you. But we must hurry. How did you sneak past the guards? I prepared a tincture of slumber baked into a pastry. Hmm. Looks gonna really be deceiving. Let's go before they wake. Wait. Where are we going? What's your angle? Angle? She did defend you in court, and right now she seems to be your only option. Fair point. All right, wherever we're going, there's gotta be food. Well, this is serendipitous. You're telling me. Did you say something? What? Uh, uh no. <laughs> Please, after you. You sure this is a good idea? I mean, aren't you gonna get yourself in trouble? Don't worry about me. Besides, I couldn't just stand idly by while they treated you so unfairly. Who are those people running the trial? You mean the Council of Sepul? They're the leaders of our city. They settle all our disputes. Judge and jury all rolled into one, huh? Efficient. As you can see, our land suffers. Everything that corruption touches... It breaks. Yeah. I saw it up close. It's real fucked up in there. Uh, not pleasant. Indeed. Athia's all but lost. Where did the break shit come from? I'll tell you soon enough. We must keep moving. So where are we going, exactly? We should make our way to the Lower City. The Lower City. Got it. What were you even doing at the courtroom? No one has arrived from outside the city for many years. Everyone in town wants to know who you are. The price of notoriety, I guess. After what you called the break shit. Uh, let's just go with the break. After the break occurred, people fled their villages. Sir Paul is the last bastion. Damn. I would advise staying off the main thoroughfares. Less chance of being spotted. You know, we should stay off the main thoroughfares. Less chance of being spotted. You're right. Some schmancy houses. This is where the nobility live. Ah, huh, yes. The Upper East Side. Technically, we're in the north of the city. Far out! She can't have got far! It appears they've noticed that you're missing. Head for the shadows and keep moving. Stick to the shadows. Great idea. Why can't you be more like her? She likes all my ideas.
You are safe now. Uh, thanks. We are close to where I live. Come, I have food. Bit of a half-hearted thank you, I must say. Nobody does anything nice without wanting something in return. I have trust issues. Hmm. Do you trust me? <sighs> well, you and I have is an unholy alliance at best. I couldn't get rid of you even if I wanted to. She did just risk her own life to get you out of jail. Point taken. Plus, she promised me food. And don't you want to know what she wants? It's quite the mystery. More interested in the food at the moment. We can speak freely here. I am Odin Keen, daughter of Robian and Callista Keen. Oh, uh, I'm Frey Holland, daughter of who the F knows. I don't know how to respond. It's okay. Boring story. I'm over it. Liar. My father was a notable cognizant. Cognizant? Cognizant. You say tomato, I say tomato. Tomato, tomato. You are very strange, Frey. Cognizants are Athia's most highly respected scholars. And my mother was a general. Oof, that is a lot to live up to. Wait, was? I've been on my own almost my whole life. I don't know what that's like. I don't have any parents. I had some foster ones, but they never really stuck. So you must feel the same way. That we got royally screwed. That we must help others. Tomato, tomato. This is my home. You live in a bar? Uh, above. I like you more and more. So about that food? You had this on you the whole time? I needed you to follow me. Frey Holland, daughter of who the F knows. Hmm. Just Frey's fine and not uh, well played. Well, thanks for the jailbreak lady and the apple, but uh, this is where he part ways. Please wait. I need your help to save my homeland. Uh, mystery solved. That's not happening. The circle of bending light, the rushing sound. That's what brought you here, yes? You want to go back home, don't you? I may be able to help you. I'll give you to the bottom of a drink. It's like one of those medieval themed bars. Hey! Sorry, I didn't see you. Give it back. Come on. Second rule of pickpocketing never give back what you stole. What's the first rule? Don't get caught. What is it anyway? Something that ain't worth crap here. Well, if it isn't worth anything, why can't I have it? Nice try, Munchkin. Now scram! A pint of your finest ale, my good sir. Oh, a hell of a kick. You guys do not mess around. All right, let's hear it. This isn't gonna last long. My father researched the phenomenon known as the Tirana extensively. Tirana? The tunnel of light you traveled through. I believe his work holds the answers you need. I could give you his findings, and- Here it comes. In return, I want you to find his research notes on the break. They are- In the break, right? It does not seem to have any effect on you. So they say. Many have tried to find what's outside the city, but they don't get far before... Before what? You are the only hope we have. You're special. 
Okay, you obviously don't know me. <sighs> I want proof. Uh, follow me and I'll show you. And thank you. I, I haven't said yes. Do you believe her? I suppose anything is possible. Some chance is better than no chance. I do not want to go back into that hellscape. Come on, it'll be fine. I'll be with you after all. Not comforted. Is this, then, your folks? Yes. It was painted when we were at one of the Cognizance guilds. Father was one of the Cognizance of Janoon. He had the foresight to move his work to Praenost just before the guild in Janoon fell to the break. So your dad's notes are in Praenost? Yes. He brought me here to keep me safe from the break. But it wasn't long before he went back to finish his work. That was twenty years ago. I never saw him again. And the break eventually overtook everything outside the city. Could you tell me about him? He was a brilliant man, beloved by many. He was close to finding a way of slowing down the break, maybe even reversing it. People put their faith in him, believed that he would make the world how it used to be. I'm trying my hardest to continue his work, to keep hope alive. Here, these are his notes on the Tirana. Yeah, yeah, this looks familiar. You can have this after you help me. Quid pro quo, I get it. He kept his notes on the break and read journals like this one. I need you to find them and bring them back. Okay, so I go and get the journals, bring them back, and then we're square. That's the full extent of my savioring. I will do everything in my power to help you get home. You have my word. Cross your heart and hope to die? You wish me dead? N no, no, it's a, a phrase we have on our... <laughs> Forget it. I shall pretend those words were never uttered. Good. Okay, I'm in. Why not? It's not like I've got any better options. Oh, this is good news. You're truly helping the people of Athia. Uh, not why I'm doing it, but yeah, sure. If you're planning on heading into the break, you'll need to get some rest. I'll go in the morning. You got anywhere I can crash? Crash? A crash. A, a sleep. Oh, of course. Follow me. You can use this room whenever you like, and I'll prepare a change of clothes for you. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Thank <laughs> you. 
Fucking day. Still can't tell if any of this is real. And yet it is. Now rest. You have another big day tomorrow. You look like one of us. But your shoes betray you. These have gotten me out of a lot of scrapes. Where I go, they go. The kick stay. So it shall be. Here, you also need this. It's a map of Athia. It should aid you on your journey. Here, I've marked the cognition skill. Perfect. Thank you again. Tanta's blessings. You too, whatever that means. Maybe you should grab an apple. An apple a day. We'll keep phrase hunger at bay. Such a poet. Thank you. 
So, how do we get to this Cognizance's guild place? If I'm reading the peasant girl's map correctly, we'll need to leave the city by the south gate. Alright, let's get going then. Tantus blessings! Hang on, who the heck are you? You're not the one they're saying came from outside the city, are you? Well, just don't go causing any mischief, you hear? Tantus blessings! Hang on, who the heck are you? Fair maiden, a moment if you please. Pray, lend me your ears. I have a fine song to play you. Very well. Then allow me to regale you with the ballad of the enormously clever person of Sipal. Was that really the best title he could come up with? Well, did it speak to your soul? Did the doleful melody call me un again? But of course. What manner of minstrel would I be? Did I not go wandering over hill and dale in my dreams? You thought. Escaped criminals roam the streets and still you do not cease your racket. There is a crisis afoot. Forgive me, but there is always a crisis afoot. Well, you may have a point there, but nonetheless... She's a guard, Frey. We need to get out of here, now. I, uh, guess I'll be on my way then. Wait. You. You're... So sorry to see you go, fair maiden, but go you must. And quickly. <clears throat> that was a little too close for comfort. But we got away, thanks to the fop. Dream wanderings indeed. Yeah, and that song. What the hell even was that? <laughs> Sorry about this one. He's not the bravest. It's not often we see an unfamiliar face. <laughs> Where did you spring from? This is all some kind of bad dream. I can try to wake you up with a short, sharp blow to the face, if you like. Yeah, you could try. If you're in the market for a dent or three. Aye, aye. Were you the girl I heard about? The one who came from outside the city. What's it like out there? Come on. Tell me, tell me. I want to know. Oh, wait. My mum says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. around here look a little shabby. Maybe we could help fix things up. I'd imagine it's more a lack a of... A cat. I'm so glad they have cats in Athia, too. Let's see. Flaggy little creature. Worth chasing it down, perhaps. junk right there. I suppose there's nowhere else to put it all if they can't leave town. What do you want us to find here? Is this for me? Mm -hmm. 
You're no homer, but you're cute. You're no homer, but you're cute. Blessings be upon you. You. You are the escapee. Please, I beg of you, do not harm the children. Are we there yet? Oh, no. Oh, no. That soup they served us today didn't taste of anything at all. Huh. And that rotten Councilman said we'd get the same food as the upper city. A likely story. Liars, the lot of them. I do pity those who are born here. Why? Because the outside world is so dangerous? Yes, they'll never know anything but this. There's even more guards out looking for you than us today. And Councilwoman Dax is in charge of them. He warned she's not to be messed with. I'm so glad they have cats in Athia, too. Why, exactly? Do you have some special attachment to the ridiculous little creatures? Huh? What? No. Yes, you are. I'm so glad they have cats in Athia, too. Why? Exactly. Do you have some special attachment to the ridiculous little creatures? Huh? What? No. Miss you, Homer. Short trip. How the hell do you get out of this dump anyway? I know a way. You. You've been following me, kid? No. But I know how to help you. Really? I know everything around here. Mm-hmm. And what's that gonna cost me? An apple, maybe? So you have been following me. Sure. You seem hungry. Just follow me. Don't you want to know my name? Not really. It's Olivia. And you're Frey. Everyone's been talking about you. I guess I'm kind of famous around here. Does famous mean hunted by the gods? I call it finders keepers. Damn. Did you steal all this stuff? Not all of it. You're growing on me, kid. Sometimes people have no idea what they're throwing away. I often make new things out of this stuff. Here. Yeah. If you get hurt, this will help you heal. All right. Nice. You'll have to give me the recipe. Of course. Let me teach you how. Try it.
People really do throw a lot of stuff away, huh? Yes, a lot of useless rubbish. Wait, this might come in handy. Hey, Shorty. I got you something. That thing you said isn't worth crap. No, not my cell phone. And thanks for not swiping that again. I don't steal from friends. Friends? Cool. Uh, well, as your friend, I got you this. Wow. What is that? Are you a taunter? <laughs> it's a pen light, and... No, I'm not a taunta. What's the deal with those guys anyway? They were the strongest and most powerful women in Athia. They all had gifts. But in the past, 
They use them to help protect the land. And one day, they will again. They'll come and save us. Oh, listen, kid. From personal experience, you gotta look out for yourself. People only really get saved in fairy tales. Wrong. You'll see. All right. Well, uh, I got a split. Um, you said you knew the best way out of this place. Well, if you climb over that wall there, that should help you get to where you want to be. Cool. Thanks. I'll uh, see you when I see you. I'll keep the city safe while you're gone. Sure. You do that. Almost there. Roger that. <laughs> 